everyone welcome to the new video on Azure backup and if you have been following this track in the last video uh, I showed you how you can run a backup of your domain controller so as you can see on the screen is that uh, we backed up a folder with the name test which is residing on our domain controller for this demonstration I'll show you how you can uh, recover in case of data loss by using the Azure backup server so let me go to my domain controller uh, expand the file explorer and my C drive and the test was the folder that we backed up and in this I also have a text document and what I'm gonna do is for this demonstration I will delete this folder and we'll see if Azure server can uh, restore that so let me just delete it so as you can see that the test folder is gone and I will also remove this from the recycle bin Let me flip over to my Azure server and uh, from the left pane you select the recovery button and uh, you can see over here the recovery point for C drive you will highlight the test folder that we have done the backup for and you select recovery button and now our visit is open so you select next and we want to recover this to the original location and I want I will leave all these things to the uh, default but if you want you can also specify over here the recipients in case you want to send the notification for so select next and you will hit the recover button so the recovery pro progress is initiated and uh, we got the successful notification. So let's just flip over to my domain controller and see that if the test folder has appeared. So as you can see, the test folder is here. And if I click on this, I have even the text document in this one. So you get the uh, granular recovery. Even the text document which was there in that folder was recovered too. Now I hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching.